Hello guys, Nick Z again. Uh, I've been working on this contraption here again and uh, got net up to four bulbs uh, showing the amplification effect. And uh, I've taken this, this one bulb here off of the, uh, the three turn coil and all the other bulbs uh, are also off of the three turn coil. So all three are running off the three turn coil. That Wema capacitor there. I've just got this uh, hooked up temporarily with these wires all over the place so please excuse that. I also made my bridge rectifier. I don't know how well you'll be able to see it right now but uh, it's uh, it's got the four MUR 1560 diodes on there and it's hooked up to a capacitor a single uh, Jesus I don't know what it is I think it's a it's a 400 volt 200 microfarad capacitor right now so um, what I wanted to show you is just basically what it does with with the four bulbs instead of one or three or two so I'm up to four here and I just wanted to show you the effect so I'll turn on the uh, little switch here and uh, the scope is on I don't know how well you can see it I'm gonna turn off this lamp here for now so you can see it a little better I think and uh, well okay here goes the switch Sometimes it doesn't come on. Do it again. There it goes. Okay, so um, so those are the four bulbs going. Now, if I turn the catcher off, this is what I get. Not much. Catcher back on. Get that. Catcher off. Okay. Now, notice that when the lights first come on that's really what I'm seeing before that dimming effect so consider that again and watch it again with four bulbs okay I'll get a little closer shot here if possible catcher off actually the whole system is off and catcher on so four bulbs system off. Now the catcher is running from the 28 turn coil. It's running through the new rectifier bank which by the way does not heat up like my other ones and uh, it does actually provide so much more power to the catcher that that I fried this little this little coil in here. Uh, probably have to replace it so it kind of overheats now because it, it cooked that coil. I was running about, I don't know, 30 or 40 volts into the catch, <laughs> something like that. Um, before it was only 17 to 19 volts. When I changed to this better rectifier system, I'm getting more voltage to the catcher. And so here it is once again. Again, it didn't turn on. I do it once again. There it goes. So, this is what the rectifier 